Hey guys, I'm Janet on occasion, and today we're continuing on with our Repulse de Lyonnaise campaign. And uh, yeah, we're going to fight Queek, aren't we? Yeah, that was the plan. So uh, we're going to do that. Because uh, we can't auto resolve, despite the fact that this army kind of sucks. Um, I think we'll be fine. These assassins, I think we'll just get killed by foot squires in seconds. I mean, Queek's going to be a bit of a problem, but we can just sort of ignore him. So, um, yeah. Should be pretty easy. Let's do it. Alright, so, oh my god, this again. This again. This happened in, um, I think it was the uh, Lithanar campaign. Which, uh, that episode may or may not be out yet, but this map I had uh, show up in the Lithanar campaign. I believe it was. And, um, yeah, this weird shadow bug on this map. Like, the lighting is uh, wrong. It's all wrong. Which is very odd, because this map used to be totally fine. I don't know if it's just a specific setting I've got. Or, I don't know, some weird quirk. Now that I'm in, you know, I'm using 2K resolution instead of 1080p. So, like, I don't know. It counts the pixels from the camera. I don't know. I have no idea. But this is super weird. I hate it. I hate the lighting like this. Ugh. Just the shadow doesn't get rendered. It's weird. It's weird. Although, saying that, I think I did put the shadow quality down. So, maybe that's it. Though, I can't imagine anyone being happy with this. This isn't shadow quality. This is just shadow being broken. But, oh well. Whatever. Whatever. It's a thing. Right, let's uh, let's position these guys out. Oh, let's get the Beast Laser Baston in there as well. So you guys line up. And let's get you lot lined up as well. Uh, Sir John is now on the Hippogriff, which is lovely. So we have a Hippogriff and a Pegasus ready to attack. So let's get them over one side as well. And uh, yeah, that'll do, I think. Cool. I didn't mean to hit gamble, but it's probably best I did. I never bother gambling. I just never do. Because it so rarely makes a difference. Okay. Charge! Quick, charge! Charge, nice say hand! Charge! You're not charging very well, guys. Can you charge better? Come. Come on now. Charge! <laughs> Come on, guys. Charge. Nice around. Okay. Okay. Nearly there. Uh. Tell you what. Let's go. Let's go goon this guy. It looks like those uh, rattling guns are busy. So it's all good. Right. You charging that way. You charging that way. I definitely want you fighting assassins. Thank you. Uh, uh, yeah, they're getting dealt with. Uh, really? You you guys actually decided to stay and fight that assassin. I hate when that happens. Night Saren. Very silly. Okay, you guys move up and around. Uh, so how are our lords and heroes doing? Fine, by the looks of it. Hard to tell, quite honestly. It's a bit of a fuster cluck, as, uh, as they say. That's what the cool kids say, anyway. Uh, right. Okay, there's a lot of nonsense going on, so let's uh, smite them. And Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, that's exactly what I want on them. Uh, I don't entirely know where they are supposed to be. Oh, that's cavalry that I need to run away. Alright, you go into those Skaven Slave Slingers. You can probably deal with them pretty well. Um, you lot, I just want you to line up. Fight what you like. And yet yeah, you keep chasing that assassin. Thanks. And, uh, okay, that, all the cavalry sort of busy. Let's all, let's get all of you lot out, actually. Let's get all of you lot out. Okay. It's a little bit of a mess. So let's get them out of there. And you two can actually jump back down. And let's get a regrowth on uh, on our lying friend. And oh, oh. Teeth breaker's coming in. That won't do. That won't do one bit. Can you not? Can you not live? Thanks. Uh, right. You lot. Let's charge right back in again. And you start going for the Teeth Breakers. Go for them. The Assassin's trying to back out, which is very like him. And Oh, and Queek's nearly dead. Cool. Uh, you go for Eshin's Triads there. It's not exactly great for you to be attacking Eshin's Triads, but, you know, what's a boy to do? Uh, I don't know why I keep saying that today. What's a boy to do? It's just, I don't know. That's my catchphrase of the day, apparently. All right, you get in there. Deal with the Teeth Breakers, all right? And here, you can have a potion of foolhardiness. Why not? Yeah, you keep chasing Queek. 
And, oh, Clan Vulcan's Tail Slashes. No wonder they're being a bit more resilient than I was expecting. Um, and that Warlock Master is still going, somehow. Let's, let's get some healing on our boys. Let's do that. Alright, you guys can back back out. And looks like that assassin's basically dealt with. So, you can get in over there. Uh, teeth breakers getting dealt with? Should be. Looks like it. Oh no, there they are. So you keep chasing them. And you did the same. Go chase them down. Cool. So yeah, they're getting dealt with too. Good. Alright. Move back over here, please. Cool. Well, those foot squires are getting wrecked. It always seems to be like one unit of foot squires per game I play. Just gets completely decimated. They're sort of on their own. Okay, level them up. And, oh, the assassin's back there. That's where he went. That's where he got to. Okay. You deal with them. Uh, who are they? Oh, I sh mm. Probably don't want to be fighting them, but... Okay, things seem to be going alright over here. Over there. See if you can get Queek. You know, see if you can get one more hit on him. Okay, how are things going over here? Like, seriously, I can't even tell what's happening in here anymore. Uh, everyone requires magic. Gotta have magic. Alright. He's going right in here. Ish. Okay. Back up around there. He still can't get quick. Still can't get him. Oh, yeah. Army losses. Everything's shattering. Oh, about time. About time. I say about time. Now it's about time. There we go. Good job, lads. Good job. Good job. Alright, job done. So, um... Oh, well, they survived, sort of. But they fled once. So, they're actually dead. Uh, so, it is a nice place to live, apparently. So, I will occupy it. Could be a mistake. We'll find out. Okay. Good, good, good. Lots of dead rats. And, uh, I think that leaves them with, what, three? Three settlements? Cool. Three more settlements. Yeah, they didn't do so well. Um, it seemed like Queek was really strong when we first went to war with them, and then they just fell apart. Um, <laughs> which is nice, you know, don't, don't mind. It's just, um, I don't know, a little, uh, anticlimactic, I suppose. Right, so that's all good. Yeah, I think I will go with, um, actually that's pretty good. Lionhearted. And Blessing the Lady is kind of nice too. Lance Bretonia is kind of cool too. Uh, let's go with... Lionhearted, so we can use Stand Your Ground more often. I like that. And you, almost immortal, almost immortal. Max that dwells below, which we still haven't used, but at some point in a siege, they'll just be like a pile of bad guys. Uh, oh, we gained, gained some spices. Nice, actually put our trade co trade income up a fair bit by the looks of it. Uh, she hasn't moved yet. Um, okay, who else hasn't moved? Have you moved? No. Nope. Uh, when I say nope, I mean yes, which is the other one. And, okay, good. So, yeah, you move there. Uh, chill. I, I don't need her to move. You move over here. You have already. And where is... There she is. There she is. She's moved as well. So, I think we're done. I think we're done, then. For this turn. Oh, yeah. Yeah, more farms. That sounds great. All right, cool. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do, I think. Moving on. Alright then, ambush are discovered. Oh no! Doesn't matter. <laughs> We're good. Uh, I was saying that, you know, this place might get attacked in a minute, and that's not... I ain't got the best garrison, so... Uh, I don't know, should this guy start heading over here? Maybe. I feel like the greenskins are busy. And it's just mostly ruins in the south, so... Um, yeah, let's build that. And... Oh, I don't know. I'll just leave that. Leave that empty. Um... Yeah, you need to really make a move over here. Come on. Uh, ugh, actually. Do you actually want that replenishment? Before I crack on. So let's move there once, which is a bit annoying. Honestly, it's a bit annoying. Given the fact that, um... Uh, I want this place to rebel. 
It obviously won't if I'm garrisoned there, but it is what it is. It is what it is. So, Sir John the Lair. Uh, I think I just want him to wait there for a second. It looks like they're gathering forces. So, yeah. Yeah, I'll just hang about. Uh, cool. I think we're good. I think that's it for the turn already. Although I need to move her, don't I? So I need to move her. And, I mean, I say I need to, but actually I feel like all of Chaos just went the other way. I haven't seen a hint of them. So, I think this whole army is pointless, honestly. Which is a bit of a pity, really. But, um, oh well. <laughs> what, you, what can you do? So, let's move on. Okay, so yeah, they're moving in. That's fine, though. We'll get more, um... What's it called? Uh, chivalry. By fighting him, so it's all good. Uh, you there, defensive alliance. I'm gonna say no. Because it doesn't help me. It doesn't help me in any way. It's just gonna slow down the end of the turn, because I'll have to watch you doing nonsense. As I change the camera, but, you know, sometimes interesting stuff happens, so... You know, I don't like to... I don't like to speed up the camera. I actually get comments about that sometimes. Saying, uh, you know, you can speed up the camera. Yeah, I know. And for anyone who doesn't know, you can actually choose. You know, even like on individual turns, you can say, I want to skip certain aspects of it. But I don't because I'm making a video series. So if anything interesting happens, I don't want it to get just like fly by and then me not be able to, to like comment on it. So yeah. So I always have it go normal speed like this. Because yeah, I just cut it out for you guys so it doesn't bother you lot in the slightest. So <laughs> I know you can change the camera. It's all good. Alright, so, devoted, another 10 chivalry. We are like a third of the way uh, to the 2,000 mark now. From the 1,000 mark that we were at the start of last episode, I mean. Not generally, because that 1,300 is not <laughs> a third of of 2,000. Anyway, we're making great progress, like 300 in, an, ep in you know, an episode and a bit. It's pretty great. So, uh, and here's another 10, which is amazing, from uh, Mertan the Devoted, who sat over here. Which is nice. Being devoted, I guess. Because he's been hanging out in a chapel again. You know? That's how he rolls. Uh, so, you keep moving along. Good. It's a shame that I'm going to have to disband her. Because, you know, he's the one that's going to be leading the army. But, whatever. Also, she doesn't need to be marched stance like that. Silly girl. Uh, eh, don't even need to upgrade that. There's not very expensive buildings that I don't need. You know? Oh, it's going to take a long time to get over here, isn't it? Still. It's all good. It's all good. Right. You need to level up too. And... Let's go with Fosica. Lovely. Lovely stuff. So, you. Rapance. Yeah, that's the one. It's the one. I'd forgotten. Forgot your name a second. Uh, oh, I can't quite reach. That's a pity. Also, we have to go all the way down here. So... What I'm hoping is... Oh, it's only minus 10. It's going to take 8 turns. Um, so we're going to go up here. Take that. Then we're going to go down here. Take that. And then all the way back up here. Take that. And then we'll run back down here and destroy that. Because, yeah, we're, we're sacking all these. We're just going to raise these to the ground. I don't know who's going to move into them. If anybody. But I'm going to raise these two to the ground. I'm going to take this one, though. Because that's... um, Yeah. That's somewhere I've already got. Sort of vested interest in. Um, I'm going to wait for them to attack, I think. In uh, Libaris, with our spices. Uh, also, I do kind of need to get rid of that and build a garrison building there. And in fact, I'm going to destroy these buildings too. Maybe I should keep that, actually. Because, yeah, there should be garrison buildings in those. Ooh, speaking of. Build that, shall we? Although, Grand Mass is closer, so let's build that. Uh, cool. Ooh, and what's here? There we go. We'll get more money out of that. Cool. So, let's move on. Hello, Quick, you want peace? No. Okay, looks like an attack. And auto resolve. Suggests that I can auto resolve this. Uh, mm. Though, do I want to do that? Uh, I think I should probably fight it, honestly. Um, though, actually, I'm a bit, a bit worried about the Necropolis Knights. Um, I mean, we do have the many times of pole arms, the nice armor piercing and anti large that can help them out. So, and the Beast Slayers of Bastar, actually. We do have the Beast Slayers of Bastar. I do like the Beast Slayers of Bastar, with their blessing of the lady. 
Very nice. Um, first up, look. Uh, squires of the Beastlayer Duke are amongst the addiest of Bretonian infantry, taking his epithet as their name for good reason. Love it. Uh, yeah, let's fight this. Oh, and guys, it's a choke point battle. Alright, we're fine then. Um, yeah, archers, archers, archers. You guys chill out the back. We're gonna we're gonna ruin these um gonna ruin these little areas though. I'm actually gonna try and keep the tents. I'm gonna try and keep the tents safe. All right, I like the tents. I'm gonna try and keep them safe. So, uh, you lot, I can basically just shove them in here. I don't need to be graceful about it. And you lot, also, I think these tents will probably have it, but oh well. And you lot go there. Do these have any archers? No, it doesn't look like it. Oh, wait. Skeleton horseman archers. That's not too bad. So there we go. That'll do. And, uh, you lot. Chill there. You lot go there. And, uh, got cavalry as well, but... Oh, wow. Look at that. Very fancy. Very fancy. I can see why I wouldn't want to give this up. I mean, who wouldn't want a big pyramid? Who wouldn't want several pyramids? I know I want some pyramids. Anyway, let's fight. Come fight me, silly boys. So yeah, this lot should do great. I've got a lot of bowmen. And, um... I can actually move him up here. And can uh, buff everyone's melee defense when these guys finally decide to attack me. So that'll be nice. Sepulchral stalkers coming in. Necropolis knights. There's a... Lich Priest at the back there. Oh, they do have some chariots. Some chariot archers as well. But uh, these things aren't pri like great archers. You know, primarily. They're not as good as just units of archers. In terms of the damage they're going to do. So if they're just going to shoot into these guys, I'm fine with it. Uh, shooting a bunch of skeleton warriors for seemingly no reason. That's fine. Okay, so the Ushabti will be coming in. Okay. That's fine. Alright, let's break the charge, shall we? Or at least give it a go. Well, I've seen worse. Alright. Good. And now, I think this is probably time for uh, for the big guns. So, let's... You're not going to move further forwards. That's very suspicious. I am suspicious. Alright, let's put it here. Let's see how many kills she gets. I have a feeling it'll be a few. Alright, three. Just three, four kills. <gasps> four whole kills! Alright, it's not that money yet, but, you know, give it time. Really? You sneaky little boys. Alright. Go go deal with them, yeah? Oh, crap. Over there, too. How did you get over there? Doesn't really matter. We are dealing with them. Uh, so, how did you do? How did you do? Te ten kills, that all. Wow, that's kind of pathetic. Alright. You just blast them with that. 40, 45 kills now. She got more kills in the Awakening of the Wood than the Dwells Below. I feel like she did a lot more damage, though. The with them, so, you know, there is that. Oh, no. He's struggling a bit, isn't he? It's fine. I can heal him up if need be. Ah, uh, right. Ooh. There we go. Alright, he's he's running away. That's fine. And, oh, more Shabti being summoned. Fair enough. And that seems to be going fine. Uh, so yeah, this is all going great. I mean, I could have probably healed these guys up a bit more, you know, over the course of this battle, but it's mostly just the garrison forces taking damage, so I don't really care. <laughs> I'm heartless like that. You know, they're lives that don't matter. So, it's all good. Um, really, they're not going to suffer army losses yet. Can you suffer army losses now, please? Go on. Okay. I should probably just save up for some more healing. But, um... But I'm not, so... How are you not doing? Doing good? Let's put melee defense. And can you stop? Okay, you lot... Shoot, shoot the Spockle Stalkers. Okay? Shoot them. Thanks. And you lot, shoot those proper stalkers. 
Yeah, fill them with holes. For the lady. Heels for you. Good. There'll be army lost in sight. Perfect. There we go. There we go. Lich Priest 2. Get out of here. Cool. You didn't get healed, did you? No. Alright. Decisive victory. Good job, lads. Alright. So. Yeah. That went alright, didn't it? Thursday's cute. And now these guys will attack. And this, I can't fight. I can't fight these guys. Oh, that's, uh, I can't even be bothered. You guys go ahead. I'll fight you in a second, mate. Just uh, just hang on. Hang on. I'll fight you in a sec. Be patient. Alright. So he died. Uh, more chivalry. Cool. Cool. For defending this time. Not even tanking. He's getting chivalry for everything. That was wonderful. And, uh, oh, wow. I can trade faction-wide. Cool. And uh, settlement lost. Oh, no. Oh no, I got a hedge wizard and a locket. Which seems um, a bit random to just happen, but sure. Alright, Mogan of the Flame, he's on his way. I don't like uh, King, uh, King Fogtem. Don't like his chances. Uh, you there. You get some basic walls. Good. You there. You cripple the rats. Good. And raise it to the ground. Yeah, that's how it's done. Court Jester, lovely. That'll come in handy later. Uh, and, oh my god, it's going to take forever, isn't it? It's going to take forever. Turns out jungles are big. Um, who knew? Let's see. Deadly Onslaught. Nice. And Henri the Massive. Be more indomitable, I suppose. Alright, brilliant. Brilliant. So, nearly there. Uh, what I might do is actually have this guy head south. Um, so, on one hand, we're leaving ourselves wide open, but on the other hand, we're allowing these guys to get more ground so I could fight them more, which gets me more, um, <laughs> which actually gets me more chivalry. So, ooh, immortality. Great. Good job. Uh, however, I think I will probably up the garrisons as well. So, let's go to the Doomglade. That might be where Queek is. If it is, then, um, yeah. Should work out well. Actually, I don't think Queek's even going to be alive, but I mean, between Doomglade and Temple of Skulls, um, yeah, Queek's basically had it. Although, you never know, could be on the island. Um, I just sort of doubt it. Let's have a look. Where is Queek? Clan Moors. Three settlements. Three? Oh, no. Which three? Did he take this one again? Or does he have one elsewhere? Is that his, maybe? That could be his. That could actually be his, because I haven't been there. That might be one of his settlements. I kind of hope so. Because that'd be cool to see Queek spread around here again. Um, anyway, what else have we got going on Di in diplomacy? Nothing, by the looks of it. Cars are correct. Still can't trade with anyone. Ugh. Rubbish. Alright, so. I think we're good over here. Uh, he's moving. He's moving further. Um... Yeah, everything else is looking fine. Uh, they're chilling. Aroness Assault Spy is in the desert for some reason. What is she at war with? Oh, Sudenberg. Looks like she's heading towards Sudenberg. That's interesting. Huh. Alright. And over here... Oh, almost. Almost there. Almost there. Almost got that other army kitted out for seemingly no reason, but... I mean, it's better to have it and not need it than to need it and not have it, right? Probably. I thought Carrie's would be making more money with the gold mine. Twelve hundred... What? Oh, income is halved, isn't it? Nope, minus 15%. How are you earning such a tiny amount of money? Does that mean that Queek is underneath it? <gasps> that could be it. Ooh, that's fancy. All right, I might have to deal with that then, huh? Not sure how, but eh, we'll work it out later. Probably just wipe Queek out, and then um, well, our income will go up, and I won't know why. Just, just wait, just you wait, guys. In <laughs> in several hours' time, 
when I finally kill, you know, wipe out Clan Moors, I'm going to go, oh, my income just went up, and I won't know why. And that'll be it. And that'll be it, guys. What is your purpose? <laughs> what the hell? Peace treaty. I'm at war with you? Alright, I'm at war with him, apparently. I didn't even realise. Uh, I don't know. High chance, huh? Do you want to give me some cash, I guess? Moderate. Nope. Alright. Stay at war with you, then. No worries. So far away, I'm never going to meet him. Can't hear Sudenberg's marching out to go fight Aranessa. Oh, going to try and ambush Aranessa. Although he's got, you know, a bunch of... A bunch of archers, and she's got a bunch of giant crabs. So, I mean... I'm betting on the crabs, but... Stranger things have happened. Alright, so... Uh, Genevieve Michaud is ready. For no reason. Ah, brilliant. We've upset Warriors of Chaos. Don't really mind. But wow. I did not realise the, the strength of that. Armour piercing damage plus 15 when fighting against Warriors of Chaos. Does that mean that all of our guys will have plus 15 armour piercing damage? Because that is obscene, if that's the case. Like, plus 15 is a massive bonus to, like, a weapon damage. That's crazy. Because, I mean, like, look at this. Look, look. 38 in total? If that's plus 15, then that's insane. I hope that's the case, because that's wild. Uh, oh, rats. Pest control. Let's see. Um, no matter how many cellar doors were bolted, tunnels demolished, or sewer pipes blocked, the pestilent ratmen always, always found a way to steal, uh, steal the Bretonian lands. Countless food stolen, gold looted, and innocent lives lost, and so came the purge. Every underground cranny was scoured for verminous heresy. Every corner scrubbed of scaven filth. Truly, it is not. It was no task for noble souls, but there was no other way. And that's going to give us plus ten melee time for all armies. That's huge. That is awesome. All right. Uh, you there, Repulse. Go, uh, go root out some rats, yeah. The old, uh, old, old rat, rat rooter. Rootings, rat rootings. Root out the rats. Uh, speaking of, <laughs> live. Just, just live. Liv Tyler, the rat. And uh, this one I am taking, actually. So I'll have that. Thank you. Uh, an extra 10 chivalry for doing that, which is good. And, uh, oh, oh, good. Good. He's the exterminator. Sadly, just leadership, not additional um, chivalry. Skaven are a disease, a cancer on this world. You are a plague, and we are the girl. We are the love cats. So, um. Hmm. Research rate plus 10%. It's alright, it. It's alright. Uh, Sejon. What should I get for you? Blessing of the ladies. Kind of good. I do like that. Um, I think I do want to start just leveling up his, um, his, uh, stuff down here. So let's give him devastating charge, maybe? I mean, hard to hit is pretty great. His, his melee defense sucks. So let's put up hard to hit. His melee defense is real bad. Uh, his, on the other hand, is fantastic. Let's make him immortal so it doesn't matter. Brilliant. So there we go, got Doomglade, etc. Uh, over here, it's going to be another turn before that's built, and it's going to attack, so... Although, we do have walls here now. Huh. Yeah, I still don't think that's going to be able to fight him off, so... Uh, though, which is a bit sad. But, oh well. It'll be fine. It's not going to be fine. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be horrible, but... Um, we can bring him back in a second. Also, she's still got water... But I don't think there's desert attrition here, so I don't think that matters. Um, but hopefully, I say hopefully that's their last one. It's just not, though, is it? What is left? There's Temple of Skulls, Cursed Jungle, and Serpent Coast. There's another one here. Okay, so it's that one and that one. That is all of Queek's. So Queek doesn't have another one up here. All right, so we're about to wipe him out, basically. Um, and that'll be another 60 chivalry, which is awesome. Cool. All right. Research available. Uh, let's have a look. That's going to make... Uh, oh, province capital buildings build quicker. That's nice. Um, income from farms. Yeah, I guess it's time, isn't it? Uh, although that one we can just buy. It only takes a turn, so we may as well. Uh, <laughs> extra made type of peasant mobs. Lovely. Oh, and that gives us chivalry. I mean, not much. The plus two control is pretty good. As well, so maybe I should go for town sensor so I can get that. Ooh, that makes battle pilgrims better. I like that. 
Oh wow, there's a bunch of military stuff we can do here. I didn't even pay attention to. Oh well, we'll figure it out. Doesn't really matter. I mean, we're already winning all the battles, so... You know. <laughs> like, any improvement sort of... Yeah, it's kind of moot. Yes. And by moot, I don't mean um, uh, where the halflings live. Alright. You start heading up there. Good, good. <laughs> just playing cat and mouse here. Just hopping back and forth. Okay, commandment available. Oh, cool. Uh, in that case, let's go with growth, I suppose. Get it built up. Cool. Oh, oh, and this is finally happening. I am cool. She's heading over there too. So, uh, yeah, we have our army over here now. Yeah, I do like that I can actually use lords to sort of ship units about um, as Bretonia, because like Bretonia is unique in the fact that if you have more lords, it doesn't increase the upkeep of all of your units. Because um, that's the case with every other faction. Like, the more lords you have, the more upkeep every single unit that you own um, sort of has. It increases with each lord you have. So the more armies, the more expensive each individual army becomes, which is really annoying. I, I find that very irritating. <laughs> I don't like it much. Because like, it, it's nice to be able to have sort of those tactical options where you're like, oh, I'll just have like a little cheap army here. Um, just like a temporary, like, bolster the garrison kind of force. Uh, which I guess is trying to stop you from just having these little armies everywhere, but still. It's a shame, I think. It would be nice to be able to do that more often with more factions. And invite you to say your piece. Uh, what is it? Join war against us, I said. Ah! Hmm. Oh, she's gone. That's weird. I'm going to say no, though. I mean, we're still friends. It's fine. I have faith in you, Sudenberg. I have faith in you. Okay, so, that'll do. Uh, yep, yep, we got more research, because of course we did, only took a turn, and maybe I will get that, because again, we just buy it. Um, and that's, yeah, construction costs down for infrastructure buildings, so we could do that as well. Uh, that's very expensive, does that cost us? In order to research technology, this amount of chivalry be deducted from your total. Okay. So extra income from trade, an additional tradable resource, uh, resource produced, but that's 50 chivalry we'll lose. Um, but I'm still kind of tempted, given that it's quite a big bonus. Ah, I won't bother. Income from farms, whatever. 14 turns, I'll just leave it. I think that's fine. Do we need all this other stuff? Probably not. Right, let's have a look. Uh, so she's immortal now, has most of the things. Uh, let's start getting flesh to stone. Cool. Okay, so, over here, we have met before. Cool. And you finish the army off. Hello, everybody. Yep. Oh, look at that. That is a tasty army. Very, very basic. Very simple. But, um, meaty. Should be good fighting chaos. Costs us three grand a turn, but, uh, you know, does the job. Uh, let's also build that, because I can. Cool. And that's all, basically all our money, so that, that'll do. Um, ooh, more level ups over here too. And you're also immortal. Brilliant. Just her and the other life wizard have been, uh, <laughs> been basically leveling up in tandem. It's quite fun. So we are slowly suffering some attrition here. Um, not attrition, the mechanic attrition, but attrition is in like we are suffering small amounts of losses every time we have a battle. Um, attrition in the traditional sense, not the mechanical sense. You know what I mean. Um, so yeah. So, kind of interesting if we end up bumping into something genuinely scary. So, yep. Awesome. Okay. Virtue of Empathy might be fun. Because, yeah, if we put up an aura, is that going to put up um, the aura of, like, you know, the banner of the fleur de lis or anything? Probably not, right? Nah, probably not. Hmm. Just a thought. Uh, Deadly Blade. Sounds good. Go Deadly Blade. Let's make a blade more deadly. It is very deadly already, but... It can always be more deadly. You be more indomitable. Okay. Ah, it's going to take two more turns to get over here. Two more turns. But still. And for some reason they're not attacking there yet, so... I guess we're not going to lose uh, Libaris. Because, uh, yeah, they have, they have artillery and they're, they're not attacking. So thanks... Although, if we have a look, yeah, we can win that. So, um, 
Shall I wait for them to attack, or should I just auto-resolve this? I think I'm just going to auto-resolve this so I can garrison. So there he goes. We're up to, yep, 1420 now. We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. Um, all right, what do I want from you now? I mean, some of these are pretty great. Extra physical resist is very nice. Go with the physical resist. And for you... For Esteban... Let's go with Woundmaker. Brilliant. And, oh, and he's actually in here. Cool. So, yep, let's level that up. Garrison's being built, and... God, I don't know what else we're building. Um, don't have much else we can build here, really. Uh, we can go with this one, Casualty Replenishment Rate. I think that'll help. And, oh yes, yeah, so, we have this other army here. High Queen Kalida. So, Mogan of the Flame. Hmm. Bit of fire damage. Let's say, doesn't seem very flamey. Oh, that, no, magic. Just magic damage. It'd be nice if you had more flames. You know, it's called Mogan of the Flame. Yeah. No flame. Oh my god, really? It's going to be that simple, is it? Uh, it might just be rating our uh, Pegasus Knights very highly. But no, no, this army kind of sucks, doesn't it? Yeah. I don't think we need to fight this. <laughs> I think it would just be tedious. Although we did somehow manage to lose some man at arms. Really? Alright. Defeat High Queen Kalida. Uh, oh, vampire counts. Love it. Also, plus two uh, rank for missile units. That's novel. Very novel. Alright. Let's see. Level up. Oh, Hippogriff. Why did I get you a Pegasus? If you could get a Hippogriff. I mean... I think it was someone else leveled him up, wasn't it? It was. Blade Shield. Why not? And you... Comet Cassandora. Sounds like a laugh. Let's do that. Excellent. Cool. So, Lamia next. And uh, we have two armies that are sort of poised to do that. Though, uh, oh, no, never mind. I only have 64 cash. So I guess I won't replace um, that unit we lost. Never mind. It matters not. Also, this matters a bit. Um, yeah, I need to deal with this. Also, look at this. Who who came up with this idea? So they're both earning less money than they should be. It's very dumb. Right. Uh, okay. I think we're good. Let's move on. All right then. So some wolves got attacked. Yes, ready, nothing happened there. So that's fine. So Rapunz, this will be the last fight against Queek. Queek might already be dead though, which you know, fine. Uh, but we'll see. We will see. Cool. So population surplus, huh? Doesn't matter at all. Never mind. Thanks for trying. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I, mm, yeah, okay. Windmill, of course. Uh, over here, oh yeah, let's build that up. Not that we really need to. And do I want to move in yet? I think I'll let them replenish and the two of them go uh, take Lamia and get some gems out of it. Mm, tasty gems. Uh, also, this place does have a unique building. What is it? Earn some money, puts up research rate and income from all buildings. In, in the all regions of the province. That's actually kind of good. So maybe I shouldn't let that falter, because that actually seems pretty damn good. Okay, let's uh, get rid of that. <laughs> I think I want to keep this now. Um, we've got money for raising it, so it doesn't really matter. So what I can do is actually just get this guy, why not? You go there, and uh, you... Oh, I can't afford another one. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, actually, it's not that like I can't afford one. So you can only build one per place, right? Yeah. So, um, again, he's going to be free, so we'll get him. And you go over there. Good. So, may as well just take him. May as well. Take these two, in fact. Take them all. Yeah, we can take all the places. It doesn't matter. Um, it's just we have to raise them first, you know. We get the chivalry from raising it, then we can move in. So, right? Probably a clever way to do it. Um, God, look at that. our chivalry now. It's getting really high. Love it. But we're running out of things to fight over here, which is a problem. Um, if we can get through the mountains, but we're going to be suffering mad attrition. So, where can we go? Where can we go? Not a lot going on the mainland that we can fight. So, ugh. 
problems. Uh, here, I guess, we can go take Skaven Blight and, well, raise Skaven Blight, attack these places. Maybe. Don't know. Oh my god, hang on. jizro has been talking about the Empire now. Oh, wow, okay. When did that happen? Jeez. This was all Marienburg. Marienburg had this, like, huge empire over here, and I very much doubt that they confederated. So, that's crazy. That is crazy. The empire just went, yep, yeah, this is ours now. Um, fair play. You know, credit where it's due. Uh, coaching in, why not? God, so vampiric. It's pretty gross. Pretty gross. But, they're still happy, so that's the main thing. Um, not great for everyone trying to travel through it, though. Sorry, Sudenberg. Sorry. Your many, 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 many melting armies. Jeez. Oh, well. Uh, right. Right. What was I doing? Ending the turn, probably. Hello, Mr. Gelt. Uh, no, I really don't need to be friends with you. So, still no sign of chaos. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting a little silly, honestly. Uh, you guys can probably start making a move, right? Uh, let's have a look. So you can get to here. Yeah, you can get to there too. Cool. I'm, you know, I want them next to each other. So if they get attacked, they can uh, team up. And should be able to get there in one more turn. So, yeah. Cool. God, look at these guys. There's just like nothing going on here. Uh, what's the garrison like? Oh, the garrison is wild. Okay, the garrison's awesome. Fair play. Fair play. That might actually be quite tough. Um, could be a tricky one. Also, this place sucks. Be happier, alright? Be be happy. Please? Also, why is that there? That can go. Okay, you, head to Cursed Jungle. You, head to Teotiqua. And you, let's build a super mega house. That's what's cool now. Uh, right. Final Skaven settlement. And it's not even worth fighting. All right. Do they not have an army? Like seriously? Skaven revealed. Wow, that was it. They didn't even. They haven't even. How did they not have an army? That's super weird. But sure, why the heck not? Not gonna judge. Uh, God, what am I gonna get, gonna get for you? Assassinate doesn't seem very good. Assault units, assault garrison. Spread public order, screw it. Let's actually do that, okay? People are happy to see you. You're a big, big fun man, okay? Big people are jolly, right? That's the. That's how that works, probably. Uh, let's go for stone, why not? Cool. Wow, that's just. Just embarrassing, frankly. Um, so I guess she can start. I know it'll cost me a bunch of guys, but um, I guess you can start taking over some of these areas. Now, I mean, we've got plenty of chivalry from that little, you know, little excursion, but still. kind of wish she was up here fighting them now, seeing as how this was such a... so easy. It was unbelievably so. Um, just no resistance from Skaven. Very weird. <laughs> the fact that the last place had no one in it seems really strange to me. Like, I'd get it if there was no one in it, and then they just had an army somewhere, you know? But no, no, they actually got wiped out, so they had no other armies. It's very strange. Uh, anyway, I think that's it for the turn, then. Nothing else we can do. do you understand? Dude, like, um, oh, military access. I mean, I guess. <laughs> it keeps them off my back. Oh, no way. What? I didn't think they like Greybeard's prospectors. Oh, well, that's upsetting. Am I going to be able to trade with you now? Well, we're neighbouring the dwarfs now. So that's something, I guess. Still a bit of a pity, though. I had a rapport with the other ones, with those prospectors. I guess when they started taking over a bunch of territory in the Badlands, suddenly they were, you know, weren't so much prospectors as their own nation, so makes sense the king would want to bring him into the fold. Well, the high king, anyway. And still no sign of chaos. So, bye-bye, Greybeard's prospectors. Uh, Wax and Wayne, which I'm pretty sure is uh, is what the Karate Kid had to practice when he was fighting the forces of chaos. So, um, as the Great Vortex uh, 
uh, vacillates on its axis. The winds of magic fluctuate distressingly, eliciting wild-eyed portents of doom from edge wizards throughout your empire. The troops are cowed by these omens, and leadership has, has decreased faction-wide. Well, blimey. Uh, actually pretty bad for, um, for Britonia, who famously have terrible leadership. Okay, so now these guys have... Uh, I think we could do like a massive awesome land battle, you know? I think it could be a lot of fun. So, we've got Sir John and Mugen of the Flame. Uh, I think we're going to want to lead with Sir John, actually. So, Mugen, you go chill over there. Good. And uh, Sir John, can you reach? Ooh, maybe. Or maybe not. Oh my god, we reached with zero movement left. That's impressive. Uh, yeah, so this should be wild. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, they're Necrosphinx. That's cool. Alright, this should be a fun battle. So, this will be the last battle. Um, well, ish. Like, once we defeat these guys, there may be something left in the settlement. So, we may have to then besiege it. But this is essentially the last battle. This is the deciding battle between us and uh, Lamia. So, um, that's pretty cool. And you know what? I am going to try and fit it in, this episode. Alright, so... Uh, what an exciting battlefield. Oh, oh, there's some enemies in it. That's progress. Uh, right, you lot. Chill there for now. Uh, go B says Baston. They're gonna hang out in the vanguard, I think. Oh, actually, I think I want to make sure that I've got that charge defense for the, uh, inevitable Ushabti rush to begin with. Uh, you lot... Carry on chilling, you lot keep chilling, and uh, yeah, let's get you on the edges. Because, uh, yeah, you're going to be helpful. Alright, brilliant. Boop. Alright, let's go, lads. So, yeah, this is going to be fun. Oh, more come from over there, didn't even realise. Should have gone for them first, actually. Eep. Okay. It's all good. Ish. Okay, see if you can't get on top of them. You start charging them. Okay. Get that. Lich Priest. Okay, you have them. I think the Lich Priest is just doomed, so that's great. Oh, took some damage there. Not happy about. Necrofex has got two Necrofex coming in. Alright then. Eep. Uh, how are you lot doing? Great, in fact. Awesome. You charge in, and you lot. I guess pull back, although, uh, yeah, it looks like we're kind of fine over there. So, oh yeah, my archers need to stop being the worst. Alright. You lot. Let's line everyone up, why not? And, uh... Line them up. You guys. So line up over here. Pull back this way. And enemy lord is wounded. In fact, everybody is wounded. Awesome. And, uh... Okay, this is embarrassing for them. You keep running. Running, running, run, running, running. So yeah, I don't like his chances. I really don't like his chances. Yeah, this is just bad. He's already wavering. Like, look at this. <laughs> this is abysmal. A poor little sod. And let's give everyone some extra uh, melee defense. Just to really rub it in. Oh my god, there's three Necrofax Colossus. Wow. Oh. Keep moving. Oh, my word. Yeah, this is all very scary, actually. But that guy's uh, toast. Yeah, he, he's toast. Of course he is. <laughs> it's really wonderful. All right, line up. Uh, let's get these guys in a goon squad, actually. Because, yeah, you guys need to deal with them. 
you guys deal with them, you guys deal with them if you can. You guys charge in, you guys get involved. I don't really want you to shoot the Necrosphinxes, go for the Ushabti instead. Uh, you two start backing up over there. Uh, you lot start getting involved. I'm going to want some people charging the back. There are Tomb Guard there, so I have to be careful. And now I've got a bunch of infantry here not doing anything. So let's get those Skeleton Warriors first. Charge of the Spearmen. I know charge of the Spearmen is not the best thing in the world, but, like, it's fine. Okay, you guys need to back up into there instead. Uh, group 2... You are still on the Necrosphinx, which is fine. There's a Hyro Titan there as well, which is, uh, spoopy. So, yeah, very spoopy. Oh, he's still chilling over there. That's fine. Tomb Guard over there. You get on top of them. This is very hard to keep track of, I must say. Nice, the Lionhearted can fall back into there, actually. Uh, these Pegasus Knights need to get out of here now. But, these archers are doing a fine job. Go for the Tomb Guard with Halberds, please. we got some archers. Let's try and get on top of them. Uh, that's a problem. They're, they're still alive, which is irritating, I must say. Uh, ooh, that's annoying. Alright, go for the Hyro Titan. Actually, Hyro Titan's he dead. Go for that guy. Go for the king. And let's heal everybody. Alright, you're not doing fine, mostly. Uh, yep. Yep, that's perfect. Uh, more... Ah, there we go. There's more spellcasters. You lot, let's go with... Uh, those Pegasus Knights getting buffed. And you go for the Ushapti. You lot, charge into the back of these Tomb Guard. I know it's Tomb Guard with Halberds, but like, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. So that's going great. Uh, you lot go over there. You lot actually try and get those Skeleton Horsemen if you can. Uh, he's just sort of chilling here. I don't know what really you're doing. That's fine. You guys run in. You guys get involved. You lot. Uh, you know what? Heal him up. He needs it. Uh, seems to be going fine. That's, yep, still dealing with him. You lot can just get stuck in wherever. I don't know. I don't know where. Wherever you like. Uh, nice, the line hired need to get out of there. Just, just get out of there. So yeah, it's the, it's the tomb guard that the problem at this point, but Doing okay. Doing okay. Uh, okay, this chapter's still going. They're all struggling somewhat, so let's encourage them. Nope, that's army losses. Job done. Alright. Well, that was fun. Do you like our goon squad? Our goon squad was cool. Ah, right, there goes Tomb Prince. Job done. Close victory. Well done, everyone. Well done. I thought that might take far longer, but... Got it done. Got it done. And wow, questing nice. Really, really cleaned up there. 135 kills. MVPs. MVPs, for sure. So yeah, that went well. That went well. Um, I mean, I feel like we didn't actually get that many kills. Um, but we just hit everything that was really powerful. The fact that we took out, like, what was it? Three Necrosphinxes. Oh my god, there were four of them in total? Yeah, there were four of them. Wow. Anyway, we took them all out. We took out all the Necrosphinxes and, like, the Hyro Titan and, you know, a couple of the Lords and just, that just swung the balance of power so drastically. So, uh, yeah. Nice and quick army losses. Lovely. Kill the battle. Uh, more things there. So, we have this. We just have it now. This is ours now. Uh, I would like 46k, but I don't want to lose chivalry. And I also don't want to smash it down, so I am just going to have to occupy it, I think. But, uh, hey, we're up to 450 now. Which is pretty great. Right, you can have a unicorn. Everyone gets a unicorn. Brilliant. Unicorn. And you. Let's see, you can have... Oh, I don't know, actually. You could Deadly Blade. Cool. And you, I guess, can have Flesh to Stone improved a bit. Cool. Is that everybody? Is that all the level ups? Seems like it. Alright, well that went well. Um... So is that it for Lamia now? Yeah, faction destroyed, caught Labaris. Right, okay. Uh, I don't really need this. So that can go. Uh, ooh, there we go. Gems. And there's some walls there. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Very sneezy. And uh, let's build a Grail Shrine. Because, you know, 
It's a capital. We've got to have a Grail Shrine. And uh, let's also build that one. And let's have a look at our industry here. So we have a tavern and a tailor's. Hmm. Seems a bit pointless. Uh, although we could uh, we could build the, uh, you know, whatever this building is buffed by. What's it called again? Storehouse. The cellar and the storehouse. We can build them in this slot where the barracks is that we don't need. Speaking of, let's get iron there. Let's build that up. Cool. Good stuff. Uh, you, though, we can take this. It's okay. Let's get a few more settlements while we're at it. Do we actually get rewarded chivalry for settlements? We have no money. All right. Search ruins, then. So we can't get some treasure. Oh, this is a nice and easy one. So question marks here. And, uh, well, you can see exactly what symbol is supposed to be there because you can see this symbol here. All the dice are the same. Just all the dice are identical. So you just have to figure out what, you know, lines up, essentially. Just figure out what lines up where, and that's that. So you can see that symbol comes off there, so it's that weird square thing. It's very easy. Boom. So, uh, alright, relic sword and a thousand gold. It's fine. You know, it's not the end of the world. It's not a bad prize. And let's search these as well. And I hate these ones. These ones I hate. These ones I just suck at, so I'm just going to guess. I'm just going to guess, actually. It's not a it's not a 1, a 3, or a 4, so it's a 2, so it's any of these two. It's not blue, because that's blue. I don't have to guess. All right, puzzle succeeded. Brilliant. So, uh, Banner of Swiftness and another Grand. Lovely. And um, now I can actually afford to move in somewhere. Shall I do that? Yeah, why not? Let's move into Temple of Skulls. This is mine now. And it's not going to cost us as much, because... Uh, ooh, actually, screw it. I'm going to search the ruins. Ah, it's one of these. Okay, we know that it's not that color. And it's not a 2 or a 1. Uh, hmm. Great. Uh, eh. Got no idea. Not a clue. Not a clue. Uh, okay, so we know it's not a 3, 2, or a 1. This one. Okay, so that's a 4. Uh, which means that... Uh, so, 2, 4... Uh, could be a three there. Could be a three there, though. So it's not a four. It's definitely a three. Um, I'm going to go yellow. I'm going to guess yellow. Nah, failed. I hate those ones. I hate those puzzles. Ideally, you want to write them down, but... Nah. Nah. All right. I think that'll be it, then. That'll be it for this episode. Uh, but yeah. Yeah, it's been good. We're making progress. We've basically taken all of this area now. Now we're just colonizing it because we can. Um, I don't know where we're going to get the other 500, though. We need to invade somewhere. But, like, everywhere sucks. Like, everywhere is, is beneath us. So I don't know if we head over this way? Like, Skrulk might still be chilling over here. So we might fight more. Yeah, I think we're just going to head over here, you know. I think, I think we're going to go to Lustria. I think that's where we need to go next. It's going to be annoying having to run all that way, but I think Lustria is actually next on the list, guys. Yeah, probably going to go to Lustria once we've colonized everything, which is a weird thought, but um, it is what it is. So, guys, if you enjoyed this, please do comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Have a good day, guys.